Hey y'all, what is up and welcome back to today's video. I'm super excited for today's video. It is going to be an update on my deck of panning project. Um, I did not get an update for this filmed in June. Today is July 4th and I am going to do the update now. So for the month of May, I need to start putting like the day, I'm just writing this down. So that way I know, I don't know when it was in May I actually started this. I think it was like the end, like the third week of May maybe, or the second week. I don't think it's the beginning of May. So I'm going to go through the products that I drew or the cards I drawed and the products and kind of give you guys an update on them. So my first one was the three, three of spades and that was the KVD eyeshadow palette and I said I wanted to use it five times and it won't look any different but I'm just going to go ahead and show it to you guys. I ended up using it four times so I'm going ahead and rolling this out because I'm pretty much hit use on this palette and I have to say like I'm really over this. I think I'm going to probably declutter out of my collection. I just don't really care for the color story anymore and I felt like the it's just not really my my vibe. So I actually feel like I'm gonna declutter that out of my collection. The next one I drew is the four of clubs and it was a vacation or travel item that reminds you of vacation. And I picked out the one size blushes. Now I have three of them. Now I really enjoy these because um, I did pick up, I think it was one of them when I was on vacation. I have orange and then I have, this is my favorite one. This is called Very That. It's like a very, it's like a lighter peachy tone. And then I have this berry one. It's really pretty. And I had a use goal on these ones to use 10 times. And I only used them 6 times. So I did get a good amount of use out of them. But I'm still going to go ahead and roll them out of my project. Just to be able to roll in new items from my collection. To be able to keep using stuff. Okay, the next one is Seven of Hearts. And it is an indie item. So I picked out this hamburger palette from, uh, what is this brand? I think it's Bombshell Cosmetica. And here's what the inside looks like. And I had to use this five times and I did use this one five times. I love this color story. It's very fun. It's all matte, but I love all the colors and it's a really good palette. So we'll be rolling this one out because I did hit my goal use. Next one is King of Clubs and it is a splurging item. So I picked out the Charlotte Tilbury Foundation. Where's that at? Over here. And sadly, I really think this is a beautiful foundation and this was an item that I splurged on. But this just does not work for my skin. It just breaks up within like an hour of putting this on. I'm probably going to have to declutter this out of my collection. I'm not going to quite yet. I need to maybe try to use this in the winter time this year. But I still get very oily even during in the winter time. So I only use this twice. And I had a 10 times use goal and this just is not going to work for me during the summertime. So that was a no-go. Next I had 8 of clubs which is an item I want to hit pan on. And it I picked out my Marc Jacobs Fantastic Bronzer. And at the time I had not hit pan on it, but I have very much hit pan on it since then because this, this item is actually in my other project pan and I'm just kind of double, double using it here. I have a lot of pan in this item and I'm happy to say when I did add it here in May, I had not hit pan on it, but I have now. So 
I'm going to roll this one out, but I'm still keeping it in my other project pan because I want to actually try to use that up before the end of the year. And the very last item is four of diamonds and it is duo or multi-chrome was the name of that one. So I picked out the Kaleidos highlighter in Space Age Prophecy and it is a very duo chromey highlighter and I had a five times use goal on this one and I wrote down here I had used it five times but I know I've used it more than that. I used it like on my eyes as eyeshadow a few days. I used it on my cheeks. I would use it on my inner corner. Like I love this highlighter. It is so good. So that is all the items in my original drawing for the month of May. I'm going to go ahead and get my cards out. I keep them right here in my little drawer so it's pretty easy to get to. I'm going to try to shuffle these pretty quick here. I feel like these are shuffled pretty good and I'm going to go ahead and draw my cards. I'm trying to remember how many I've drawn. I think it's five. Yeah, five cards. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of try to just, I like to go like this to kind of show you guys. And then I'll show you the cards I get. So one, two, come down here, three, um, four, I think I'm going to write down everything and write down the meanings of all the cards and then I'll come back and tell you guys or maybe I'll just kind of show you. So first one I got was the eight of clubs and then we got looks like ten of diamonds. We've got the queen of queen of clubs. We've got the ten of clubs. A lot of clubs today. And the two of diamonds. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and write these down in my little notebook and figure out what they mean. <laughs> and then uh, maybe I'll go ahead and pick out my products too. And I'll be right back. Alrighty guys, so I went ahead and picked out all the products and I wrote down like what they all meant here on my little notebook. So starting off with two of diamonds. It meant uh, cream, so anything cream, I was guessing, so I was thinking like cream blush. Heck, even foundation is a cream, cream contour, I just said that really weird, cream contour, cream highlighter, so I ended up going with my Rare Beauty Cream Bronzer in the shade Happy Soul. I have not gotten much use out of this cream bronzer, I think I've only used it a couple times. It's a really good product. But stuff just gets in my collection and I get stuck in the same rut, like using the same products. And I forget about going out and getting other things. That's why I really like this deck of panning. I keep cycling through products and using them. So I'm going to put down a 10 times usage goal on this one. Next, the 10 of clubs said, the meaning of that one said baked. So I decided to go with a baked highlighter and I picked out my Hourglass Diffuse or Ambient Lighting Blush in Diffused Heat. So I got this a long time ago, like in a boxy charm. Like it's been a long time ago. I haven't used it much because it's Hourglass. It's a really expensive product. So this is really pretty. I swatched it on my hand and it's a really pretty pink. So I'm going to put down a 10 times users goal on this one as well. Or maybe I should do five times. I feel like 10 might be a bit much. Okay, next for, let's see, Queen of Clubs. The meaning of that one is in it for the long haul. So I put down this Flower Beauty. This is the Get Real Serum Concealer. Now, ever since I bought this, I've been using it nonstop. I've been using this thing for months. I feel like it's never going, like I'm never going to use it up. 
Like, I love it and I'll probably repurchase it, but I just feel like I've been using it for a really long time. So, I put this one in for, in it for the long haul. So I'm gonna try and put like a 15 use goal on this one. Next, for the 10 of diamonds, its meaning was matches shirt. So y'all might think I'm wearing a black shirt, but I'm actually wearing this shirt that says thick thighs, good vibes. So it's kind of like got all kinds of really pretty colors on it. So I decided to go with the I Heart Revolution Watermelon Palette. And I felt like this really matched my like shirt really good. It's like all kinds of summery colors. So I thought this was a good pick for that option. I'm going to put down, I think I'm just going to do five times for this one. And the very last one is the Eight of Clubs and it said newest. So I actually picked out the Revolution Makeup Nemo Blush. And yes, I put this back in the packaging after I just did that video, but I'm going to put down a five times usage goal on this one. I really like this blush. I tried it out in the video and I felt like it was really good. So that is everything for my update on my deca painting for July. I hope you guys enjoyed getting to see the new products I picked out, getting to see the what drop, what cards I drew. And yeah, y'all thanks for watching and don't forget you're absolutely stunning. Bye y'all.